Welcome back. This is part five. Or no, it's not. It's Persona Five. It's part eighteen. Jesus, I was doing so well. We're gonna go to sleep for the night, though. Well, then. Last time, I don't remember. What we did. I think we went to the buffet, named our team the Phantoms. This time, we're going to the Velvet Room. And yes, now that you'd be able to tell, but this is a re-recording. Shout out to the landscapers, the leaf blowers. Autumn is apparently in full swing because they're out every single day. Go figure. First off, I'd like to begin by congratulating you. To think our master would give words of praise. You better treasure this moment, inmate! You have encountered allies who share your aesthetics, and you have found your place in reality. The time has come. Your rehabilitation will soon begin. I shall explain it to you now. You have a special potential. However, that must be refined into a useful power. It is weak now, but refining it shall grant you the strength to stand against the coming ruin. That is the rehabilitation cast upon you. It's time you learn something for once. There are various means by which you may gain the power to resist the ruin. Fighting shadows and gaining experience is one way. The fusion process I taught you prior is another. This is all possible because of our master's guidance, inmate. Though it may be presumptuous of us, we have words of wisdom as well. When you're out in reality, you better hone your relationships with those you have contracts with. Spending time with those people will lead to the cultivation of your relationships with them. If you've got time to waste, you'd better visit your contractors, inmate. That is another source of power to evade the ruin that our master has mentioned. I do appreciate Thanks the fact the that uh, you form, they don't tell you exactly what their ruin is. The power of kind of like I mentioned, I guess, last episode. The rehabilitation they just kind of let you go well. through the rehab. It's not like they're telling you this is your goal, this is who, this is the I final boss. Or it's just like you kind of just live and growth. Consider it fight the challenges gift. that come up as they come up. May the devotion to your rehabilitation grow even deeper. I have high hopes of you. Alrighty, and today we get, what, level 3 is it? Yes, and power stock increases your persona stocks to 8, which means we can now hold 8 persona. I want to say it maxes right. out at 12, 10 or 12, it's one of the two. Um, and usually I only ever use like 3 to 4 of them tops, because I have one kind of for magic, one for physical attacks, and you know, maybe I have one that does... Uh, certain stats effects or one that like King Key right now one that has pretty good defenses so you know not uh not too useful but that actually makes me think um actually there's gonna be a lot of cousins I'll get back to that later but uh I do wonder what Caroline and Justine do all day like when you're not there are there other patrons of the Velvet Room who knows you know, breakfast of the perp is the most important meal of the day. You can't miss out on that. Big ba Who eats burgers for breakfast? Wait, what? At no Wait, what? He, the dude's like, I need breakfast. Wow. And he tells him to go get dinner. That doesn't make any sense. I mean, maybe the thought is that... See, here's the thing. No matter how much I eat at night, when I go to sleep, if I'm asleep for like at least six hours, I'm waking up and I'm relatively hungry. Just saying. I don't know. I don't know what the deal is with that, but okay, it's big facts over down. here. I love how she doesn't take her. Like she takes her job seriously, but she doesn't try too hard to look like she's taking it seriously. She's like, I'm supposed to give you some some guidance. <laughs> like this is a guidance session. <sighs> I mean. I, I don't know. I guess it's kind of weird because you would think that people would have noticed. Even if she did notice, what would she have done? It's not like pe people were sweeping under the rug. They were sweeping his uh, torturous intentions under the rug to begin with. I don't see what she really would have done. Because she's just like everybody else, trying to stay under the radar. Multifaceted individuals. Ah. <sighs> 
psychology. Let's see. Humans of different personalities. Oh, like personas. Hmm. See, I always thought hmm. of this as a like your public face, your private face. You have different faces that you show in different situations. But I guess that's not what she's talking about. And learn something. What? I mean, did she scare the children? I see. I don't, I don't really understand why they look so alert, but... I mean, they look like the regular students that I always see. I love how that head motion he does where he rubs back of his head. That's like the staple right. anime. Aw, oh, shucks. Like, I just did something good. <laughs> um, pose. Hakusei from uh, Nishijo does that junk all the time. Much, but we've been getting more postings on the Phantom Aficionado website. I want to make my friend apologize for not returning the stuff I lent him. Deal with that yourself. <clears throat> hey, those girls. Shout out to the school for having interior and exterior you know rails on the stairs. Kamishita's heart? I wonder if Use that both ways. It's gotta be made up. Do you seriously believe they exist? But look what happened to Kamashita. He probably just couldn't keep hiding it after that girl tried to kill herself. Yeah, you might be right. I guess there's no way they really exist. Most importantly, it seriously sucks that our school is going to be known for stuff like this. I wonder if it'll affect our college entrance. That's probably a normal reaction for now. I just realized they wear their shoes inside. If we can take care of two That's or three things, guys, I, people I remember I said that about some exist. NPCs before. The rest of the students have on shots. The, I think they call it like wabaki, yet, right? the shoe, Plus, the slippers that you put on indoors. Kamoshita but these schools are just rocking Looks their like kicks. Just have to live a normal, honest school life for the time being. Still, make sure you stay prepared. Just I don't know if that's a difference, like in Tokyo, up, right? versus you know, more countryside or out of the way schools. That might be coming around. But not ons were straight up online. boots. We went and formed the Phantom Thieves group. Those underground boots. <laughs> Stepping on some there, fools. There. I guess sometimes things just don't go the way we want them to. Excuse me. Now we've seen this girl before hanging out in the you library. Wish to see me, Principal Kobayakawa? You saw the state Kamashita kun was in, didn't you? It's as if his personality has completely changed. Something is definitely wrong here. I'm not sure I follow. From what I've heard, it appears as though some students were meddling in his business. If they did something to him, who could they be? Are you saying that these students may have caused Mr. Kamashita to change? That is what I wish to know, even if it takes some probing into student matters. I would like you to look into this for me. It is true that there are many rumors regarding Mr. Kamashita, but do you mean all of this talk about those phantom thieves? It is undeniable that Mr. Kamoshida has changed in some way. I'd like to have a grasp of the cause. This shall also ensure that I handle the mass media and police in the correct fashion. No. Oh. I will continue speaking to Mr. Kamoshida myself. Unless you find whomever did this, these irresponsible rumors will I'm likely be on down. you. Don't you agree? You have been at the top of your class since day one. Your conduct is good, and teachers favor you. I could write you a recommendation. I'd like to know what the game devs think of the Japanese school system, because they include something like this, where there's a lot of pressure being put on the students, even if it's you know extraterrestrial, so to speak. But I wonder if this is kind of like a commentary on Japan, because to an extent it is. But I'd like to know what they think about Japanese school systems, just because they clearly. Do you understand? understand kind of the interplay of power and relationships <laughs> between faculty and students it's no but wonder you're our student council president i'd appreciate if you'd look into this as soon as possible i ask that you begin at once yes if you'll excuse me so angry look at those eyebrows i will say her voice actress is one of my favorites i can't remember her name off the top it's me sir um, my apologies we'll get into that a little bit later you at such a busy time 
Yes, it's about the matter we discussed earlier. I have all bases covered. The investigation will begin immediately. Mm hmm, of course. Yes, I will get results. I should be able to update you soon. Well then, I must be going. Thank you very much for You're your welcome. time. You're welcome. They even put the dial tone in. You could hear it in the background if you listen closely. Kind of nice. I mean, I wonder what it would take, though, for them to to really believe that they did something. Like, I don't think the fan, well, the fan themes are known kind of in a cultish way, but the police, they're probably not on the police radar yet, so I doubt that they could just be like, oh, we're the Phantom Thieves, and then the cops come and just, okay, you're going to jail now. Gosh, he, yo, he's definitely going to spoil the secret. Can't keep his mouth shut. He's the guy who's like, I'm cheating on my wife and tells everybody in town. <laughs> Just like, this is so great. Hey, have you seen that phantom aficionado website? I'm the one who started it. So there's one thing I want to say about Mishima. Get on my face, bro. Stand down. But one thing I want to say about Mishima and the answer you can give him. All of the answers are very off-putting and kind of not outright disrespectful Sorry. but just like I don't have the time of day for Whoa. you and Things I feel bad because you oh puppy um I feel bad because he really wants to be your friend throughout the game and to you guys. This he just much of a way for me ends up being the short end of the it. stick but if there's anything I can do to help just let me know like everything that the protagonist says Glad is super to reserved that. towards Mishima there are many more evil adults outside of Kamoshida but I'm sure the phantom thieves will do something they can't let this end after just one target. That's why I wanted to make a forum where people could post their problems. There are probably a lot of people who have high hopes for the Phantom Thieves' next move. So, I've also implemented an anonymous poll in the site. Do you believe in the Phantom Thieves? Well, I mean, I'm obligated to because I'm part. Yo, charge your phone, dude. Twenty percent. I'd really like to help out in the <laughs> Phantom Thieves' that. acts of justice. Can I, please? Sounds like fun. Let's do this. I'll live up to your expectations. Sounds like we're making a deal I here, promise. buddy. Even though we didn't actually make a deal, he didn't ask anything of us. I don't. Let me say. Um, he just asked us to basically help us. We're not making a deal with him. Besides the public's reaction to your group, there were others who supported you. Someone who enthusiastically cheered the Phantom Thieves on. Perhaps they were quite close. What do you have to say to that? I didn't do it. I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the moon persona, the moon. who is the moon? I, have obtained I think the that in the last game it was that really popular snooty girl. I can't remember her name right now, but she was the moon. She was so annoying because if you she took forever to unlock, and then if you screw up, she wouldn't like hang out with you. Like it was like the old school confidant style where you ended up. Uh, falling out of favor with her and then she ends up you, you have to basically re-friend her so that you can increase the confidant level. But Mishima here, his first uh, ability is to give our backup members XP. We don't have any experience points uh, or any backup members rather but that will come in handy and if you max them out we heard all your that. backup partners Jeez. get full EXP. That's fantastic. Here. So that forum is Mishima-kun's. Has he figured out our identities? Even so, I think it'll be fine. You seem to be playing it cool. I guess we should have a little chat about this later. I will say, though, a forum where people can post problems may prove unexpectedly useful. 
Anyways, we gotta get looking for a new target. And we need to stay sharp until we manage to find one. Once we do, we'll have to head into another palace. So we How do you have the best equipment? equipment and... Get that mess out of here. Wait! Oh, crap! Uh, what's with you? I really love those Don't slices of their up? eyes that pop out of the screen. Judging by that reaction, I'd assume you're going to struggle this time, too. Just a nice touch of detail. It's not like you're any better. All you're good at is English. That's so disrespectful. That's just because she's blonde and blue-eyed. Every subject. Even your Japanese is questionable at best, Ryuji. What's questionable is whether you're really even a human. <laughs> good comeback, huh? Let's discuss this with our fists. Bring it. Will you two stop it? I love how nobody's picked up on the fact that there's a cat meowing in a bag right now. Alrighty. Okay. And now we get to hang out. Here's the thing, right? Morgana says you have to study. And, huh. Okay, well, Morgana says you have to study. You don't actually have to study. You have to know the answers to the questions that were asked. So, a lot, basically the questions are based off of what was said. Um, what was said in class, like different questions that were asked of you. You have to kind of know those and be able to extrapolate certain things from them. I'll talk to Anne today. That's going to be the, the goal. Um, on Anne, Ryuji, that's crazy. All right, let me go get a... Oh, what is she? Persona, let's check. I think she's a lover persona. Do we have yeah, We'll go get a lover persona. Um, we're actually gonna stop the video. I'll be right back because we're at 16 minutes. I'll stop it and come right back. And we're back. I want to check these text messages to get this icon off my screen. I'm real compulsive with that. I don't like having extra notifications. One of the things I do in Persona, or I'm sorry, Final Fantasy 13, the data log uses these little exclamation points when you have unread entries. And I always, like, as I play the game, regardless of like when I play it, it's a new game, first time, first time playing anything, I'm going through that and I'm clearing those little things out. I'm not looking at an exclamation point this whole time. It's, it's not happening. It's just not happening. Luckily, as I mentioned, you can travel directly to new places, so you don't have to go to the hey, entrance of the social or central street, you can go to the entrance of the development, which is really nice. Quality of life in games is super important nowadays, and I realized as a kid, stuff like that, I didn't even think about it because you have a bunch of times that you're just hanging out. How but when you're older, you really do have to pay attention and consider things like the this. The inmate needs a change your mind. Actually, You'd like to read if you lack patience. The inmate needs a you wish to perform fusion. Um, Let's see. Oh, he's new. She's uh, but we don't have. Uh... I'll have to come back and do that with Phoenix and McCoy because I do want to max out. I'll show you what you can't handle this. Can do. It looks like, but he is thunder based and strength based, which is nice. Oh, wait, wait, here we go. Finished. Friend. You'd like to read the compendium registration? Uh... These right, are the paths you have um, walked. We want lovers. I believe she's lovers. I'm almost 100% sure she's lovers. Oh, Lee Is this what you Lee, want? Lee Nan Sire? Sid? Sid? I don't know how you say that. I'm probably just going to go with Pixie. Is this It'd be what cool you if want? I got that just because she's super, super dope. But I'll go with Pixie. Don't want to be too old. Okay. fee is required. Then accept this persona. And also, the level of the persona that you get you doesn't make a difference. Uh, like whether it's it a level three or level inmate. forty-seven, it doesn't impact how you get your confidant ranks. It's just the fact that you have one at all. I kind of want to go to the Big Bang Burger, but I'm trying to max out everybody in this playthrough. I probably won't max out everybody. I've never done that. I was actually working on a uh, playthrough in which I was trying to max everybody. I never finished that playthrough before I finished this, or before I started this. So I kind of turned this into my max playthrough run. I wasn't following a guide for that because it is less, uh, less stringent. Uh, yeah, that's word. I think so. Um, Tell me about your problems. <laughs> I'm not sure why I'm making two very different phrases, but I guess they get to the same end. Well, let's hang out with her. Thanks. Um. This is uh, one of the diners that we can go to. I don't know if I unlocked it on the map, but. It's really cool. You can get, I think it's, oh, 
want to say... I want to say there's something you can get with Guts. There's like two stats you can get here. It's neat. You come back here for some other confidants as well, which is kind of cool. It's just... I like these little set pieces, you know? I also was thinking about... And maybe I mentioned this, but Japanese architecture as a whole... Uh, let's see. She's so strong. She's so strong. Um, <laughs> Japanese architecture as a whole is really interesting because the outside can be really cramped because there's you know a premium on space, but the inside, they do a great job of making it look like somewhere that you want to spend some time, and I really appreciate that. Hey. That's part of the reason I really want to go there, just to kind of experience that disconnect between outside and inside. Shiho trying to be that D1 volleyball player? I gotta say, I respect volleyball though. Um, yeah, I'm a basketball fan slash uh, former player, so to speak. And uh, I think if I didn't play basketball, I'd play volleyball. It just looks like a lot of fun. You can't blame yourself. Let's go with that. Hopefully. Oh. Alright, that's good enough. That we had a cutscene. It was a nice animated cutscene. I wonder what they ate because they have. He has a huge bowl, and it's a fork. It looks like a puddle of ice cream, but it could be you know, some kind of other dish. And this is like more of a coffee house Thanks. than a, I guess full-on restaurant. Um, what do I want to say? I just couldn't ignore you. There you go. Let's see if that works. That's great. That's great. You don't want to be too cocky with Han. She she deals with a lot, and I think honestly she had one of the most dire storylines, <sighs> especially for someone who's supposed to be like 17 years old. that triple bypass <laughs> strengthen your heart that way all right it's a deal let's do that let's break it down break down these walls of society <laughs> strong just means having more experience points that's really really all that means I would like to see a game a couple things in which the, main, the, the other main character, not the playable main character, but they had personas that they could switch around. Like, let's say you give them a pool of, say, five personas, and they're all, you know, for Omni, they'd all be fire-based, or really all be... Uh, oh, girl talk, that's kind of useful. Which, I think we already saw that shown off. Like, it's already unlocked, because I think some of these, because I maxed her out in the last play in the original game, some of the abilities are still there in New Game Plus. Uh, anyway... You know, but let's say everyone had a pool of like five personas based on their type that you could kind of switch around that different, oh, yeah. you know, strengths and weaknesses, so to speak. Even though like they're based on the same element, but they have different like one's good at magic, one's good at physical. Like that'd be kind of cool. And they could tend to make the enemies a little bit stronger, a little bit more diverse. Uh, not to say they aren't mm -hmm. already, but it might be cool. I was also going to mention if the, what if this Bye. game had a crowd mode like Kingdom Hearts, where you can play it from like getting no experience. Because you see that online. Uh, with different RPGs, people create their own challenge runs, but you can't exactly do that here because your personas get strength. Hey. Oh, let's go! We can go outside now! Let's go. We're doing that right now. We're doing that today. Um, but yeah, you can't really, even with like an artificial challenge, you have to keep going back to the Velcro room and getting weaker personas hey. just to, you know, hey. not go over your level cap, so to speak. Um, I don't want to do that. I want to... Let's see, is there anybody? Shibuya? Iwai and Speech Giving Man. Alright, so those are the two confidence. Iwai is the gun shop dude. Speech Giving Man is the Speech Giving Man. Now listen up. But we're gonna, we're gonna walk out the door. This is such a good song. It's the lyrics now. Maybe it already had the lyrics. I don't know. Okay. Here we go. I had to walk here though. I wanted to really get the full effect. Actually, we're just gonna go to um, 
And now we'll walk, we'll walk. Like, this is just one of the things you have to do. You have to take in the city at night. I mean, not that anything really changes other than the, the time of day, you know, the color scheme, so to speak. It's just nice to see, see everything in a different light. Literally, <laughs> a different light. Um, all right, here's what we're gonna do. Get the beef bowl shop. Best work. I love the uh, English usage here. But you know, Beko, which I don't know what Beko means. It's not like another word for mouth, I don't think. It's something, who knows? I'll look it up maybe. Alrighty, Central Street. Um, beef Bowl Shop. I guess it's right on the entrance of Central Street. Okay. We're gonna go there because I need to unlock that. Talk to me. I almost gotten into you. I'm your boyfriend. I couldn't leave. Oh, that reminds me of Red Dead Redemption. I just bought Spider-Man. Haven't gotten it yet. It's coming on a Friday. It's currently Wednesday. But I might have to get Red Dead Redemption. Dude, didn't play the first one. But it looks like a nice little... If you liked GTA V, you're going to like this. It's just Old West. You don't have cars. You have horses. And I can get behind that. I do prefer Grand Theft Auto. I think heavily prefer Grand Theft Auto. But they even said there would be heists in this game. And... That, or at least that's she, the woman on the video, used the word heist in the PlayStation official gameplay video. So that's kind of cool. I like the heist from the first game. Toss mm -hmm. my guy. Please consider what I have to say. Reach out to the truth, you say? Persona 4, you say? You. Yeah, I'm interested. Hmm. I don't know if you had to do that and get him to the beef bowl shop. Like, I'm assuming that if you just walk to the beef bowl shop, he shows up anyway. Um, but I'm not too sure. Alright, look how beautiful that is though. Like, the sky is all gray and overcast and dark. Those clouds are hella dark though. Like, those clouds are really dark. That's Those are black clouds. Yeah, black plague up there. Um, but I just love how you know everything glows in the nighttime. Talk to me, dude. Transient man, respect kid. Don't see too many people like me, do you? Sorry. Art student, huh? I was cool and everything. Art student says, keep him in mind for later. <laughs> that drug dealer guy I think not the suit guy but the other or I guess they're both drug dealer guys or maybe not they're just the Kaisha uh, oh it's uh it's Simon from <laughs> Dura -ra -ra. that's dope hey Shibuya <laughs> you know how he talks you know how he has that English on that English down pat uh, you trying to start something like I love his inclusion here because again you know obviously Tokyo isn't the most diverse metropolitan area but you do see you know people who aren't Japanese and I, I appreciate that they included him just because like, oh yeah he is a little different I need to find okay this is the movie rental shop oh. um, alright uh I guess I'll rent a movie Good day. Uh, Bubbly Hills 90210 and uh Good rate. Oh, like ghosts, right? Like ghosts. That's crazy. All right, cool, cool, cool. Um, where's the beef? Oh, here we go. I could just look at the mini map. I always forget that I had this mini map, and this doesn't really look like a mini map, you know? It looks more like a. I mean, it looks like a mini map. This doesn't really look like a beef bowl shop. I'm sorry, <laughs> not the mini map. It looks exactly like a beef bowl shop on the map. I just realized there's a slight echo to the music. I've been expecting you. He has the most generic voice I've ever heard in this game. It's crazy. I've been expecting you. Like just no no inflection, no nothing. What is the work and take? Take customers' orders, prep them, serve them, 
Ring them up. Like, you're legit doing everything. Clean the You're a one-man army. The meals are ready-made. Are there any other employees? Not quite. No. I always love how this is what the back I'm counting of on Japanese you. offices always look like. Just like the little, the one computer, the desk, and then just like lockers that mm. are just a mess everywhere. Alright, let's do this. Hey, wait! Just one angry looking face. Oh, I like how he's just on the counter. That's definitely in violation of some health codes. Nice job. Alright, how much are you? 3,600 yen? What's that? Sanzen Rokaku? Oh, what? My phone? Fell? Where is my phone? What? Alright, whatever. I might have the table. I don't know. Oh, is it? It's not in my pocket. Alright, so that gives you some, what? Proficiency? I don't remember right. what proficiency you Let's used for. Oh, I guess the tools. Yeah, I guess tools. So most of the stats you use for like confidants and you know things of that nature, selecting answers in in text. Uh, but proficiency is actually used to build something, which is kind of nice. But you have to do the beef bowl shop twice just to be able to unlock the dude over there. So don't worry if you think that you missed it. Hey. I don't know if that's common in. Japanese train systems like the uh, having little monitors. The ones that I've seen online, they don't seem like they have that, but again, I'm not too sure whether that's a growing trend or not. Pollen warning. Okay, that's good to keep in mind. Hot Spots of Tokyo experience are in Shibuya. Monorama, you hmm. say? We heard about him earlier. Yup, yup. Yep. Yep. <laughs> what is that? Textbooks. I wonder how they got her to say that as like the voice actress. Okay, here's what we need you to say. Yup, yup. <laughs> Take the line wherever you want it to go. Didn't they make an anime out of that? I mean, like, there's an anime out of every Japanese myth that I've heard of. Like, <laughs> just monetize that stuff. What's the question here? Do you know the answer? A femme fatale. Exactly. A fatal femme. Morgan Le Fay from Arthur Legend and Queen Salome from the, the Bible. No way. Yeah, he's he's super smart, dude. Like, that's crazy. Nice going. Alright. Hmm. Alrighty. Uh, are we done here? Are we done here? I think we're done here. Alright. So it's been a good Oh what? You're you're talking to me now? None of these posts are you're any talking good. To me now? Everyone's just bitching about their parents episode. or their boyfriends. Uh, there ain't they better not take my whole after school time too. Palace. We can't get everything online. Finding a post with a name and location is asking a lot. Guess we just gotta find one ourselves then. Are you seriously suggesting we look for a target that even the police have overlooked? Yeah, you're right. We should probably just hold off till exams are done with, huh? We can wait and see for a little longer, then worry about coming up empty handed if it happens. I'm actually gonna check the calendar, see if the see when the exams oh. are. What are you doing here, nosy student? This place is off limits, you know. Did I ask you? <sighs> we'll get out of here once we're done chatting. Anyways, what's Miss Council President want with us? The troublemaker, the girl of rumor, and the infamous transfer student. Interesting combination. <laughs> Great way to start a conversation. By the way, it seems as though you got to know Mr. Kamashita pretty well. Not really. I 
don't know why you would think that. Yeah, you know, he's only been here a month or so. Hmm. I heard Mr. Kamoshida used a volleyball team member to spread details of your past record. Don't you hate him? Mr. Kamoshida, I mean. Oh, I guess that's what Mishima did. He spread... What's all this about? News of our My friend here's an upstanding guy. Bad. I don't behavior. mean to offend. Many students have been shaken up by what happened with Mr. Kamoshida. The rumors about that odd calling card esque posting aren't going away either. I didn't expect someone like you would care about that tactless stuff, Nijima Senpai. Oh, so she's older than us. I don't know that it was tactless. Anyways, we done here? We can't leave if you keep talking to us. At least try to understand my position. Being forced to deal with this horseplay. Horseplay? Ah, oh, yes, by the way. It's been decided that this place will be closed off due to the yeah, incident. People jump I heard some people are coming up here without I mean, permission. we're up here. It's obviously us. I'm sorry to have interrupted you. What was that about? She's on to us. That girl seems rather sharp. We should be cautious of her. She really pisses me off. <sighs> Talk about a pain in the ass. That reminds me. Study hard. Especially you, Ryuji. There are bound to be traps that will need to be solved well, with brains. You don't have Keep any. in mind that everything you do in your daily lives has an impact on your abilities. True. Studying won't be so bad if we just think of it as helping us prepare to be phantom thieves. I guess you got a point. But man, it's just so lame. I was all fired up about helping people, not about studying. Kind of said real world. Well, real I world do activities. have somewhere interesting to show you beforehand. You guys did originally promise to help me out with my mission, after all. Do we have to do that now? Are you doing a whole spiel huh? right now? Mission? Follow oh my me. god. I'm just gonna let this play. I have to get up and check my phone. Uh, don't mind me. What are you bringing us here oh, for? Maybe I won't get up because if I get Just up, my, I might like, you. pause and you know what I'm saying. All right, I've got the Phantom Aficionado website up. Now what? Look for a post with a full name in it. I already said there's no info on any big shots. Don't you remember? But man, people actually go put someone's real name on here. That's some scary shit. You won't listen to what I say. No, wait. There's no name on this one. Someone's bad mouthing me in online chat rooms. This one's got a name. Ignore those. Aren't there any posts about more serious trouble? I don't know what to do about my ex who's stalking me. His name is Natsuhiko Nakanohara. It says he's a teller at City Hall. A government worker's stalking someone? That should be a suitable target. All right. Now get the meta nav ready. We're just gonna jump right into a palace? Fine by me. Hey! What happened to all that talk of unanimous decision? What do you think we should do? Well, let's do this. We have to. It's part of the story. That's what I'm talking about. Okay, then. Yo, she let's didn't even go. make a choice. She was just like, I need to know what we she need needed. We need a name what and a place, do, right? And then I'll make so a decision. The name is... Actually, we don't need a location this time. Just enter exactly what I say. The key word is... Mementos. Huh? What are you trying to pull? Just listen to me. It should work. I think. Ah, jeez. That again? Uh... Mementos? Candidate found. We got a hit? Just as I thought. Okay, let's see if this glitches out the recording. Probably will. Don't be surprised if there is a stutter or something here. Everyone disappeared. It kind of feels like I'm walking on air. How do you is know this that Nakanohara like like guy's palace? That's half right, but half wrong. It's everyone's this palace. This is a type of palace, but it's different from the normal ones. Come on, let's head down. The shadows here lurk underground. I don't quite understand why. It may be because they're drawn to something. Underground? How? You use it every day on your way to school. Follow me. Uh, wait up, cat. Into the subway we go. Hopefully, we're not much longer for this. Here we go. Cool. What the hell is this place? Wait, 
Our clothes changed? The shadows know we're here? Since the moment we stepped in. You should have told us! We're still safe right here. I've come to investigate a number of times. Shadows never come up to this floor, but it's a different story once you go down. This place is simply teeming with them. More importantly, what is this Mementos? It's about time you start explaining. Mementos is... everyone's Called palace. It. Huh? What do you mean, everyone's? A palace as grand as the previous castle only forms when a person's wishes are extremely distorted. So instead of many individual palaces, the general public has one gigantic shared palace. That's where we are now. Mementos. I love how all this otherworldly stuff now that you is mention it, organized This place like this. feels a bit different from Kamoshida's palace. When you say shared, you mean they're all put together? They're randomly generated. Even though they're Come just strangers? Think of it as the collective unconscious. No, never mind. You wouldn't understand that. So what you're saying is... Using this place, we can even change the hearts of people who don't have a palace? Correct. The steps to do so are slightly different, though. But this place looks pretty huge. He turns into a boss. It seems the time has finally come. Morgana, transform! And there you have it. A new set of Come wheels. now, Panther. Ladies first. A car? For real? No way! This comes from the way cognition materializes in the metaverse. Plus a bit of extra training. It's not eyes. dissimilar to how you guys transform. You turn it into a car is totally different than our clothes changing. For some reason, cats turning into buses is an extremely widespread cognition among the general public. Why a bus, though? No idea. Wait, why didn't you do this at the castle? I would have if I could, but that castle was cramped. There were tons of stairs, and no way this fits on top of a chandelier. Hey, Skull! Ladies first! Hey, stop pulling me! That's dangerous! Panther! Please be gentle! All aboard! Let's go! Really just got the back seat, like there's not a steering wheel right there. Why are you there. all just sitting back there? I'm a car, remember? I'm not going anywhere unless someone drives me. You can't drive yourself? Do you know how to drive? I've driven in a game. Have that Gran Turismo. That's a bit worrying, but I'll let you handle it. I don't even have that experience to lean on. You're probably more skilled than I am, too. All right, then. We'll leave the driving to you. And no, there's no auto drive. We'll start in this the game. engine. You can't drive you if it's not control. running. Jeez, what a pain. Where's the key to this thing? Why would you need a key? There's a switch just down next to the steering wheel. <laughs> that tickles. Lower. Lower. Oh, there! That feels so good. Uh, is that Purin I hear? Oh, what a creepy-ass car. Don't underestimate my meowdery engine. We're going full throttle. It's time to fly! Okay, do we have control finally? Oh my goodness, not ready for this. Uh, I think we can go back to the entrance and save. That's what I want to do. Whoa! Um. And again. Can we? Oh my god, you can't go up. Well, I'm going to stop. Oh, here we go. Can I go back up? That'd be great if I could go back up. Joker. All right. Well, we're gonna end the episode here. I can't save the game, but we will stop it, and I will see you in the next one. So thank you very much for watching. We will kill this target and uh, see what lies in store for our protagonist in Mementos next time. Thank you for watching. Have a great day.